Hey everybody, hope you're doing well. I'm uh, holding up just fine myself, going a little bit stir crazy, you know, kind of researching what's going on in the news, looking at different news sources, wondering uh, which ones to, to really believe and trust. Maybe there's a little bit of truth in everything, in all of it, but uh, there's much different opinions about what's going on that I'm finding. Who knows what the future holds? This is something that, at least in my lifetime, I've never seen. And so we're just going to have to see how this all plays out. Uh, I know the president recently said that we've got a very difficult couple of weeks coming up. And he stressed, very difficult. But then we'd see a bright light after that. And I'm just wondering what factors are in play in this whole theater of events but as long as we've got food, water, and shelter, we're going to be fine and ways to kind of offset the, the stir-crazy factor. I know that that's been something that I'm going back and forth on myself. Let's all hang in there, and I'm sure everything's going to be fine, and I wouldn't trust any one news source on any of this personally. I try to keep an upbeat tone on my videos, and that's not going to change. Let's take a look at uh, what I what I was able to film on my phone the other day and see how it all shook out. Let's take a look. Savannah, come on. tractor supply I got everything that at least I can get from tractor supply but the handle on the hitch uh, jack it didn't it wasn't complete and so I was working with Jim here's Jim he's being super helpful hey and friendly look what we fixed look what we made here <laughs> this is an excellent handle when you don't think you got a grip on it you can always come up with something yeah yeah exactly if it doesn't work I can figure out something else but I just want to give thanks to Jim for helping me out and getting this thing to where at least I got a crank uh, right out of the gate so thank you I got a hitch mount, as you saw, the plate that I'm going to use on the front of the bus was on sale. It was the last one and it had a reduced price, so I got that going for me. And uh, they didn't have the heaters I was looking for. I want something that's 250 watts and theirs were bigger, ideally 250 watts and then a higher setting from there. But uh, I don't want to tax my, my battery system that much and I don't think that I really need that much, I need supplementation, you know, I don't need a heater heater. But I didn't like their drill bit sets because they didn't have sets that went up to a half inch and I didn't want to buy one separate. And I didn't like the tips on them. So I'm gonna head over, I'm right across from Harbor Freight. I'm gonna head over and see what they have. They're gonna have a much better drill bit selection and see what their heaters look like. And I might end up taking a lap through Walmart on the heaters that could be my best shot at it and little spring clips. There's a million uses for them I'd like to add some of those to the mix. So let's get this all loaded up and uh, get on with it Walmart, they uh, 
didn't have heaters, they've got fans out. Heaters and fans are always in the same place in the store. But I asked, and yeah, they put them away for the season. So I have water to get left, and there's another Walmart beside that. The only place I know that has a purified water station in town, it's Bashes. So I'm gonna head to Bashes. Walmart number two. That's it, I got my water. And so I'm pretty well supplied for the time being. I'm just waiting on the winch to come in from Mike. Otherwise, it's a little bit of hurry up and wait around here. I've got some projects on the motorcycle I can certainly do. I'll put some links in the description of a couple of news videos that I saw that just give me pause. I, who knows, who knows what's going on. Stay safe and stay positive. See you guys soon.